Okay, so yeah, the yard sales this weekend with the kids were mostly chaotic. Lennon, stop touching stuff, dude. And all we did was buy the kids toys. Um, but I got two things. I got this um, Rocky uh, soundtrack vinyl, and I just saw this and I saw I thought that was really cool. Got Dolph Lundgren on the back and everything, and you know the vinyls in there, and it looks good. I haven't tested it. Um, I don't know how much it's worth, but I paid 25 cents for this, so I'm not going to be too upset if I wasted my money. Worst case, hang it on the wall and, uh, um, you know, <laughs> it's kind of neat. The other thing that's really cool, um, this guy had some of his own photography framed up like this. Um, well, not framed really. I guess this is just the glass, um, but, you know, you would add your frame. And he does these close-up pictures, and I noticed this one because it's a 57 Chevy, which is the project car I'm going to be working on. And I kind of told him about that, and we got to talking. I told him I have a 55 Chevy as well, and, you know, that was his first car. So, long story short, he handed this to me and said, here you go. And he gave it to me for free, and I just thought that was really cool. Um, I think his name's Kenny... And uh, I told him, wow, thanks a lot, man. That's that's super cool. And as soon as I get the uh, the 55 Chevy out of the shop, um, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll drive by and see if he's out there. He doesn't live too far from me and uh, let him look at it and stuff. I don't know. Maybe, maybe let him drive it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right. Thanks a lot. All right. So my best day ever on eBay. Um, I sold six things today. I'm usually happy to sell one thing. Um, I was out at the uh, zoo with the kids today, walking around, looking at giraffes and stuff. Um, and my phone was just blowing up. Uh, I was getting offers and questions and, yeah, and some sales, so weird. <laughs> but very cool, so I'll show you what, uh, what things were ordered. Yeah, this is the... So this is the first one. Um, it's a uh, Camaro parking light lens. It was out of package. I recently relisted it as out of package just because how, I mean, you can see it's very torn up. It was like technically in there, but I relisted it, made it cheaper, and then I took an offer of 25 bucks on it. Um, somebody's getting a real good deal on this because normally, as you can see, 73 something here, that's a... Uh, you know, it's normally a lot more expensive. So, and I'm charging five bucks to ship it. So, um, that's it. all right. Next is tail light lenses for a '64 Chevelle. I sold two of these. They made me an offer on two of them for fifty bucks. So I took that. Um, they're getting a good deal, and it's uh, making progress for me. Um, next one's this. Uh, Dome light lens for a 68 to 70 Chevelle or GTO, and uh, you don't get a lot for these. Like between six and seven bucks is what I got for them, and I'm doing free shipping, so I think maybe on my next one I'll charge some shipping on this just to make it a little more worth it or something, um, or maybe just hike the price a little bit um, and still be you know retail on it, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, so by the way, like this is so annoying. All right, I got these crates and I pulled four different lenses today, um, which is great, but I keep stacking, you know, I'll, I'll pull this one off, stack it there, pull this one off, stack it there, because it'll be at the bottom. And then the next one will be at the bottom of the huge stack I just made. So <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's no big deal, but I, I need a better system. Uh, when I get the bigger garage, I'll do better. Okay, next one's a 71 El Camino parking light lens. Yep, another one of these going out. This guy didn't even make an offer, just paid full price. So thanks for that. Um, let's see, what was the price? It was uh, um, 48.60, and I'm free shipping that. <laughs> okay, these last two orders are kind of out of character so far for what I've been selling. Um, 
but it'll make sense in a second. So, um, one of them is this Nike Golf uh, New Without Tags Polo, um, you know, fit dry. It's really nice. I got a great deal on it. I'm not going to make a lot on it. Um, I think I paid six, and I took an offer of ten plus shipping. And it's the first non hat clothing that I've sold. So I figured I just want to try it once, see how it goes, and see if I'd want to sell more stuff like that. And the other one is three of these white tea and ginger um, Bath and Body Works lotions. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, it makes sense, right? Because you work on your cars, you get your hands dirty and messy, but then you got to go golfing. And you need nice, you know, well cared for hands so that you can golf better, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I got the um, the lotion at a uh, garage sale. They had like a, a bunch of it, and I got it really cheap. So I'm making a decent profit on those. I'm selling them for six bucks a piece, and I just paid a little over a dollar a piece for them. So um, I did get a message from the buyer on the lotion. I was charging five something per for shipping and they asked if they bought more could they get a discount on shipping and I figured out how to go into the promotions and just give them a uh, a discount um, you can do like free shipping after a certain quantity and stuff like that so that's what I did <laughs> alright I'm gonna get these packed up well yep there they are all packed up ready to go it looks like not that much, but um, for me, yeah, like I said, um, six orders is the most I've ever had, so pretty cool.